my name is Andy Tattersall. Uh, this is part of a series called App Hacks. Many of the videos are aimed at medical uh, and health related students uh, and, and uh, clinicians, but some of these are also to help you conduct your own research as part of your research kind of process. The one I'm going to show you now is a tool called RefMe. RefMe is a tool that allows you to capture uh, data such as a barcode and uh, scan it into your mobile device and it'll bring the bibliographic data into your into your uh, app, the app RefMe app. It's a reference management tool, allows you to export your references and do various other things. So I'm going to show you how it works now as part of this video. So this is uh, RefMe. When you start with RefMe, this is what you'll get. And you start by um, adding a project. So let's say my project is my dissertation. I'll click Add Product uh, Project. I'll type in dissertation, like so. Just press OK. And then I've got the option to start referencing. So if I press the bottom right plus button like so I've got an option to scan book barcodes I can search by books or journals I can put in a URL or I can put in things manually what I'm mostly going to show you here is the book uh, scanning because the use of this is you've got a mobile device you're in the university library you find a book you want to take the bibliographic details of that book um, and a good way to do that is to use the uh, uh, book scanner so if I just press the little camera icon there it will bring up the desk so now you can see a desk I've got a book here with a barcode so I just hold the barcode in front and it brings up the bibliographic details of that uh, book so if I'm happy with that I can leave it as it is if I want to add pages for parts of the book that I've used if I click pages I can say I've used from page 44 to page 45 click Save and then click done and you'll now see that that reference has appeared in uh, my uh, collection on the right. I can go in and change the style of the reference so if I press change style now I'll start off with the most popular I'm using Harvard but let's say I want to go with AMA if I do that that will then change to AMA. I can then export the reference if I wish if I click export I can um, email it to myself, I can send it to Evernote and it will send me the reference as it should be included. I can add other references, like say I can go in and search for a book or journal if I press that. Uh, I've got an option to put in the title, the author and the ISBN. So I'm just going to try uh, this one here, hopefully it will work, 978. Um, so I'm just going to type this in, if you bear with me, 019-514-9289, and if I hit search, there you go, it's brought it in, health statistics, that's the book that I've got, so again I can go in and quote things from this, I can add an annotation to that reference as I could do with the other, if I hit the annotation, I can just type in some uh, text, hit save, that will stay within there, and then click done. And I've now got a second uh, reference, the one that's got a note with it, and again I can, I can export that the same way. So I can go back into this and I can search via journals, I can search via authors. So I'm looking at books, I can also go to journals, I can put in a DOI, a digital object identifier, um, I can put in a URL and uh, hopefully it will bring it up and then you can say that's your reference collection. There's also an option to put in URL and I've also got the option to put in manually. So I can go through here and I can select what I want. So if I want a journal article, I can then start to put in the author of the article. Once I've done that, it will open up all the others, the uh, title, the name of the journal, the year it was published, the volume, the issue and the page range and there are extra uh, fields that you can add. So really that is uh, RefMe, very useful reference management tool that you can use on your mobile device.